in the factory of Sudzucker in Rhein am Lech, Germany. 12,000 tons of sugar beet per day are processed from September to the end of December. During this campaign, the factory is working 24-7 without interruption. This requires maximum reliability and efficiency of the plant equipment. The same criteria are required from the pumps. Sudzucker have for some time now used Egger pumps in various parts of the process. Typical preferred design features are vertical cantilever glandless pumps and hydrodynamic seals. Both options provide low maintenance and safeguard against dry running. These benefits contribute to the continued and efficient operation of the plant. Three Egger cantilever pumps are installed on a floating pontoon, which provides a constant prime level. These pumps are referred to as river intake pumps. They supply river water to the production plant for cooling all year round and are located about one kilometer away. Sugar beets are washed and cleaned with flume water. After this, the wash water containing stones, sand and pieces of beet is pumped away by a 200 mm vertically dry mounted fully recessed impeller Turo Vortex pump. Since 2001, this heavy-duty centrifugal pump with an open impeller and hydrodynamic seal has been transporting Clairs in sugar production. The liquid has 72 to 75 bricks at 70 degrees centigrade and a high density of 1.4 kilograms per liter. This requires a very efficient and reliable pump. A dry-running Egger cantilever pump is installed on the barometrical dip tank located under the stairs in the sugar house. In the so-called Paula Kasten, all the wastewater from the plant is conveyed to the stacking pool by this pump. This wastewater pump conveys filtered service water to the rainwater tank. Three cantilever pumps fitted with 90 kilowatt motors each feed the heat exchanger located in the condensation plant with river water from the river Lech. A total of 40 Egger pumps are installed in this plant, all contributing to the reliable and efficient operation during its high demand period.